right, what's up my single chat? How y'all doing? Because today we are gonna be having some therapy. We are gonna be checking out the homie Blame Truth's video. Apparently he got way too angry in this video I'm hearing. The title of this video is Modern Warfare 3 devs are banning and harassing people that wreck them in game. Apparently there are devs that are playing with cheaters, supporting cheaters as well. Yeah, the cheaters that like to like the homie face swag apparently swag was also caught getting shots on his bunda as well you know what i'm saying <laughs> we're gonna get into the video boys like the video subscribe if you're brand new you can always t change it into a dislike if you do not enjoy it check this out though lame truth here the cod father himself bringing you another video you're gonna notice this is not mw3 this is battlefield 2042 for my gameplay guy, Sefi, this game has made quite a comeback. I, I really yeah. can't believe how much this game has come back from Yo, just... Honestly, I downloaded last night as well. I played one match and needless to say, it got in a little bit better though. <laughs> It got in a little bit, okay? Yeah, on, just, just, on, just a little bit. Just, just a little bit. Even though I'm a massive Battlefield and Call of Duty fan, though, uh, and seeing how badly they handled this game at launch, and now looking at it, the way they handle it versus how they handle it at launch, it's a night and day difference. And you know what? Everybody clap it up, man. Likes out for the... <laughs> For the homies over at DICE, man. Uh, I, the, 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 I hope the next game is better, though. At launch. Death. To, to not only, I, I don't know, kind of reinvigorate itself, but, I mean, the last I checked, it had 30,000 players on Steam, like, in current players, and it peaked at 100,000. That's... That's really, really good. Damn. If we compare that to Call of Duty with yesterday's video, that's probably about what the new Call of Duty got on Steam. Honestly, it, it's that's impressive. I, I have to commend the dev team for not giving up on this game. Yeah, because Modern Warfare 3 is brand new. They're also combining Modern Warfare 2 with it, Warzone, <laughs> literally everything on, on PC, on Steam, and it got 100k players, which is good, though. But you gotta understand that, like, they are combining multiple Call of Duty games, and the player count is 100k versus battlefield that had, had 30k and now it had 100k and this is like almost a two years old game though Bruh. yay oh. that that's crazy to say the least though uh i don't know i hope you guys enjoy the gameplay on it we're, we're not going to talk about the gameplay though we're going to talk about modern warfare 3 devs and how they're scumbags uh, <laughs> this is oh. yes Yes, let's check it out, man. Let's check out some toxic devs because they want to constantly label you and I as toxic gamer, right? They, if, if you criticize, if you ask for one thing, suckers are just asking for, hey, can we get a good game at launch? Devs are like, you're toxic. You're problematic. You shouldn't be playing our games. That's our Western modern day ESG, BlackRock, or it wasn't BlackRock, yeah, Vanguard, BlackRock, supporting devs. Those of you who you know, you know, okay? Do not look too deep into it, guys. Don't look too deep. A weird video to make. And like the video if you know about and it. And I'm not really sure how to do it properly, so I'm just gonna wing it, and you guys can draw your own conclusions. Uh -huh. But it's been kind of a meme for the past several years that the Call of Duty devs don't play their own game. And who can blame them, really? I mean, it, their game's... Their games are terrible. And honestly, I'm not a dev or anything, but I'm right there with them. I boot up Modern Warfare 3 and I sit on the menu and contemplate committing Suicune, you know, the Pokemon. Uh, but uh, I don't know, man. It's, I just can't play it. I, I boot it up yeah, and I sit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But how many of you guys don't even have the game, though? Bruh. You know what I'm saying? One in the chat if you bought the game, you're loving it. Two in the chat if you bought the game but hating it. Three, if you did not buy it. <laughs> You're like, yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna buy it. I'm not gonna buy it. Because in Urdu, I would like to say, some of you, I know that you know that you have to listen to the people and listen to the people that it's sweet or sweet. This is the talent you have. If this is the talent, and you didn't buy the game, what am I saying? You just tell me, man, tell me in which year in which year I have 10 million subscribers in which year. Tell me now in the comments. Tell me now. Ladies and gentlemen, those of you that did not buy, that did not buy GG's. Sit there and I'm like, I'm just bored. I am bored. I'm bored. 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 I'm bored. I've seen all that game has to offer done better in the past. Like, I, I will play it more for the channel, I promise. I know it's entertaining when I do it. And I need to kind of force myself to do it. It's just, it's my job. You know, I, I gotta do it. So I, I will do it. Just give me some time, man. I just, I'm just holding off as long as I can. But anyway, back to the topic at hand here. The devs don't play their own game. That's, Damn, that's what shocking, I want to get at. They, they rarely, if ever, play their own game, but that seems to have changed recently. It seems the dev team are actually playing the game. Now, which dev team? I, I don't know. I, I don't know if this is Sledgehammer we're going to cover in this video. I don't know if it's Infinity Ward. I don't know if it's Treyarch. There are so many dev teams working on every call of Yeah, right? Like, there are 3,000 devs, and I'm hearing now it's like 3,500. 
Like 3,500 deaths. Bomba Crazy, crazy. Now different things. So who knows what? Who knows what's what here is all I'm going to say. So don't go harassing anybody. Uh, just draw your own conclusions here and let me know in the comments what you make of all this because this is the weirdest thing I've ever seen. And um, right, let's get I, I into it, bro. Well, let's just get right next. Up, next. Get into it here. So the Modern Warfare 3 devs. Uh, I don't know. Somebody sent me this and I could not believe it. Let's just cover this right away. And warning, it, it's a big graphic, honestly. So someone was like talking to a dev. And you can see up there oh in this image here that uh, the dev's name's Lexasaurus. So they're talking to this dev in a whisper, and the dev is being not very dev-like. I mean, uh -huh. the first like thing said to this person, this U.S. Army veteran person, uh, is, "Hope your family dies in a house fire because you have obvious aimbot what? or something." And then you can read the rest of the jargon if you want. He says, "Yeah, keep laughing. Bye. You're gonna send that straight to Activision." <laughs> Yo, my guy's like this guy. That guy, this guy, I'm gonna snitch. My guy be snitching out there, but the fact that he is verified, got that optic uh, representation going on. Uh, same except actually, you sound like you're 12. He says, yup, you still have time to change youngin, uninstall the game, and get your head in some books. You're losing your account, friend, but you lasted a while. Lexi, find me in the credits. So literally, uh, what what's the word? doxing the guy saying his full name i'd only read lexi here i did not read like this full uh uh, uh name uh while lexi while well, there is full name there uh, i guess Bumbaka! if you actually worked on the game then no wonder why it sucks so much <laughs> then listen man suckers have the audacity to yeah i mean what you're saying is facts right what that guy is saying is facts like hey man your game sucks whatever right you worked on the game the game sucks okay b but but dog like you bought the game though you are playing the game. You have paid them money, and now you are saying it sucks so much. Yep, it sucks, but dog, like, you are losing that plot. You have lost the argument uh, because you already paid the money for it. If all Activision employees suck as bad as you, then I'm not surprised that... Oh my god, it's getting spicy out here, though. Uh, then I'm not surprised that the game caters to noobs as much as it does. QA, but nice try, and enjoy the ban. Oh, it's a QA tester, though. Bumble Club boy. Bumble Club! QA, Lamau, no wonder the game is buggy as <laughs> Yo, yo, this guy is crazy, bro. <laughs> You don't, you don't know how QA works. We don't choose what gets fixed. Uh, my guy says, like, I'm dying. And he says, K yourself. Like, K-I-L-L -L yourself basically means self-delete yourself. Like, actually, please. Damn. Damn. But um, you know, they claim to be a dev, and they, they're listing their name, first and last name. And then the very, the very last line is a, a KYS. As far as I can tell, this is real. If it's not, I apologize for being duped or whatever. We also have the devs are teaming up with cheaters. I mean, it's not necessarily a dev. It's like a QA guy, right? So, okay, next. What about this one, though? You know, this one is insane. The devs teaming up the with cheaters. The has this to say on Twitter. A team of salty MW3 devs, including this guy, Phenarx, or whatever, what a weird name, are playing with an alleged cheater and are threatening to ban those they think are cheating. Absolutely power tripping. The alleged hacker has been called out multiple times online for cheating. His recent move now is to tell the players who beat him he will get them banned because the last kill was sus. His name is Chavos and there's his ID. He is Damn. using a top 250 calling card. His Twitter, it's Chavos. Peep their IDs in my scoreboard. He has been called out many times for cheating. Please ban them. And he tags all the Activision and Sledgehammer and, and yeah. Call of Duty devs and stuff like that. And if they are devs, these guys need to be dropped. Uh, thank you, Mr. Lesville, for the clip and evidence. Drop him a follow. Um, do not check out that Chavos guy's Twitter. I, I clicked on it just to see what it was about. And this man retweets like E-Thoughts, uh, butt-ass naked <laughs> doing things, you know. And like, what? Man, Yo! I stuck a lot! Yo! Damn, son! Okay, my guy chasing the pom pom. You saying he's chasing the pom pom? Guys, don't chase the pom pom and smash the like button. The pom pom will blind you to the bum 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 bum. Don't chase the pom pom, man. I, I mean, listen, it kind of explains, right? Like, why we have those uh, hey, 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 friendly It kind of explains. I mean, the devs are thirsty as hell. I believe it. I don't even have to see the Twitter account. I believe it. I believe it. The the Twitter is infested with the pom pom. The devs are loving the. I mean, listen. Even I love the pom pom. We all love the pom pom. Like, uh, but but yes, there's a difference, man. When you are at your work, damn, bro. 
Like, come on, bruh. Like, we don't need, I mean, yeah, Blame Troop selling the retard helmet, that's one thing. But you guys making the friendly UAV online, 20 pounders, uh, packing that heat, bruh. Underneath that, uh, that, that tablet, that iPad looking score streak thing, right? I mean, damn, bro, we don't, we don't need that crap in the game, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, them chasing the pom pom publicly, posting about the pom pom. Kind of makes sense, though. Uh, like, kind of makes sense why we have all that crap in the game. And nobody wants to see what you're jerking your gherkin to. Don't retweet pornographic material. What is wrong with you people? Disgusting. Get out of here. Uh, you know, jerk your gherkin in the privacy of your own home. Keep that keep that stuff just under wraps. You know, yeah, incognito like... mode. Incognito mode. Yeah, all yeah, right. yeah. Um, that, that's Agreed. about it, though. I'll leave the video. I cannot put this video in my video. <laughs> it, YouTube will not like what is said. Yeah, man, they will not like it, bruh. I'm not even sure what the hell we talking about. It started from gaming, and now we here, boys. This recently just happened, though. Check this video out, guys, and I will see you right there. They don't want you seeing that stuff, bruh. I, I swear to God, we had some massive trauma. <laughs> Click on it, and I'll see you right there.